I'm having lighting issues again because I'm inside my craft room and so I thought maybe if I got up really close to the camera that you would be able to see my face and I wouldn't look like a ghost. Last week I went to a giant mega craft show and I got to meet a bunch of super talented crafty people that you may recognize from YouTube or the blog world and some of them agreed to dance in this video. Oh yeah, it's coming up next. It's a mega craft show, it's huge. It takes all day to see it and there's everything inside that you could ever imagine. Mod Podge, glitter, stamps, clay, duct tape, it's all in there and we're going in. But my plan is to ask people to dance, like do a little awkward dancing like I do at the end of every video. And we'll just see what they say. They may do it, they may not. CHA takes place every year in Anaheim, California. Some of the most talented designers gather together to showcase their products and their work. I was super excited to meet some of my favorite artists and crafters there. Be sure and check out the links below. You won't want to miss their blogs and their YouTube channels. Now for your comments and the winner of the Rit Dye Giveaway. So the first question is from Hallie Katz. Where do you get your inspiration from? I've had a store for 19 years and when I first opened it I had zero dollars and I had to literally transform things that I found in the trash and at yard sales and if I didn't do it then I would be out of business. Coming up with ideas has never been the hard part. There's other things that are really hard, like talking on camera and editing, all of that is hard, but the ideas are not hard because I've been doing it for a super duper long time. Laura Crawford is the next question and she says, Yay, you're back. Can you do more DIYs? I love them. Last week I was three days late and I got a bunch of comments saying, Yay, you're back. I try and get them out every single week, and if I don't, it just means that I'm having issues with the video. It's either my computer, or the project didn't work, or I'm just feeling cranky and I can't get in front of the camera. It could be a bunch of things, but I do film every single week, and I try not to be late. The winner of the Rit Dye giveaway is Sandy Van 13444 Congratulations, Sandy. I will be sending you an email and getting your Rit Dye right out to you. Thanks for watching.